Hello there. So I needed a job. I was looking in the paper and I saw an ad to be a zookeeper. So I applied for the job. Wait, what's this for? Whoa! Oh! So if you like being a creepy zookeeper, wait, hit the like button, subscribe, and enjoy. Before we begin, I want you to put down your scribble. Ah. Uh. My name is Paul, huh? Oh, I don't get the sign. Excellent. You made the right move. Just a couple more things and you'll pull your family out of poverty. I really hope so. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists? I thought this was a zoo. True. Never thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo. <laughs> Hope you got the joke. Excellent. Now let's get started. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations, you've taken the first step to becoming a part of our close-knit zoo family. Wait, what's this for? You'll find out later. Hey! You finally awake? Good. Get up. It's time to get to work. What the hell? What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? By the way, I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after the shift. So I got the job? I thought we had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. <laughs> what? Oh. Oh. Uh, okay, cool. I don't know if I like the body cam style, but sure. All right. What you got for me, big boy? It's quite spacious here. Yep. This is our hub. You'll have plenty of everything here, except time. Now we're in the cold room. Time. Yeah, we store herbs, vegetables, and fish while the meat gets ground into portions for the animal rations. And right now, we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Okay. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in your PDA. Uh, load two herbal and one vegetable bricks into the trolley. How do I do that? Whoa, that's real sensitive. Um, huh? Are you deliberately wasting time? Shut your mouth. No, I'm not. I swear. This is just a lot to do, okay? Uh, right, okay? Am I supposed to wait for you forever? Wait, was it two? Oh, oops. Wrong one. I'm already goofing. That's not fun. Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve. And take these ones with you. It's time to show you our workhorse. Okay. So am I... What was that? There's something in the works that you're not ready to know about yet. Let's start with the basics. And here is our K-A-T-I-E. Kinetic Automated Transport with Innovative Engineering. Katie will take you around the zoo. Oh, well, Katie, now. This is the refrigeration compartment. You need to load the brick trolley here. Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. To load the brick trolley, you need to activate the lever. All right. Pull the lever, crunk! Now, select the giraffe enclosure on the control panel and start the train. There's blood here! Oh, here. Right, got it. A bit more and you'll be left without explanations. Fasten your seatbelts and sit up straight. Let's go. Okay, sure. Giraffe, you say? I always wanted to be a zookeeper. Where'd you go? Whoa! I don't like that smile. So we're at the giraffe station. Now listen carefully, I won't repeat it twice. This is our mobile veterinary station. Here you'll be mixing medications for our animals. Are they sick? Well, they can be. 
We need to closely monitor the health of the animals. We have some quite rare specimens, so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question. Take this seriously, and we should all be safe for another day. Follow me. This is our kitchen factory. To collect feces for tests, you have to feed the animal its favorite food. Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Excellent. The zoo needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. All right, enough chit-chat. Go to the cutting table. Okay. You need to select the giraffe from the list. Okay. Press on the cook button to go to the slicing screen. Okay. Click on the cut button to slice the... The Don't earth. make a mistake with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. No, Paul, that's too much. It's not enough, Paul. Add more. It's not enough, Paul. Add more. It's not enough, Paul. Excellent, Paul. Cut. Oh. Do the same with the herbal brick from the rest. Oh. Go ahead. Oh. Oh. Now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. Wh oh, right, the gadget trolley. Fun. Now, the trolley to the gates. now drag the trolley to the gates. <laughs> oh, you gotta drag it? What? I have to do this backwards? Why not? I never thought a zoo could be organized like this. A train. Trolleys? Yes, Paul, our zoo is quite unique. It's our pride. You won't see anything like it in others. Pride? The I don't know about this. Closed for the second year. People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. How long have you been working here? Long enough to teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. Mm. This is the entrance to the enclosure. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA into the enclosure terminal and select Open Enclosure. Okay. Right. Welcome to the giraffe enclosure. Before leaving, make sure all symptoms are detected. Are in the enclosure. Now we need to feed our little creatures. Take the bucket and dump the food in the feeding area. Take the bucket. What? Where's the bucket? <gasps> Hey, buddy. Are you guys hungry? Wait. Where do I put it? Oh, how do I how do I feed you? Probably here, right? Ah, feeding area. God. Ah, delicious. <laughs> Turn the bucket to the gadget trolley. Got it. That wasn't so bad. I got to feed giraffes. Um. Oh. Great. Now put on the MFE. What's that? Mobile fecal extractor. Okay. In simpler terms, a shit sucker. You've eaten shit before. <laughs> now you're going to suck it. I don't know. Why do we need all this? We need to constantly monitor the health of the animals, and taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. A hundred thousand a year, Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. Come on, Paul. Don't chicken out. What do you mean, chicken out? How would I even see poop? Is there any poop here? Cleo? Can I pet you? Are you gonna eat me? Ugh, nice tongue. Okay, cool. I have poop to suck! Hello, giraffe. Ah, poop. My favorite. Oh. I don't like that. I... I do not like that. Oh. Oh, no. Now take the TIS. To avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. 
It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. Okay. And that's here, right? Good. Now install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Okay, measure the temperature, huh? What? Oh. Hello, guys. Ooh. Yeah. Wait, come here. Something's not right here. Hmm. Bow is fine, although. Although, how is not doing so good? Oh, okay, task complete. Now I gotta run back and tell him about it, right? Is that what we gotta do? Clean up after them in the morning. Some gadgets are still lying around on different stations and storage rooms. When you're there, grab those too. What? What was I? Return the gadget to the trolley. No! All right, exit enclosure. What'll happen if I don't exit the enclosure? In the terminal, you can check all the analyses you've collected in this enclosure. All right, take the trolley back to the train. Take the trolley back. Medications too? Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn, how do you know all this? Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. Got kicked out in the first year. No worries. That should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. <laughs> I don't like this guy. I really don't like this guy. I really, really do not like this guy. Congratulations, Paul. You've just come closer to success and the well-being of your family. Now, go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver. You don't carry anything into the car. Everything must be sterile. And don't forget to put the shit sucker back in its place. Okay. If you say so. Sure. I'll just put this back. Okay. Now what? Where'd he go? Ah. Uh. Whoa! Why are you so jumpy? Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the lever inside the car. Yeah. Yeah, you... I did it this time, but in the future, you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. But keep in mind, chum, there are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Okay. Sure. Uh, I need to do Temporalex, right? Create. Now take the dart from the dart dispenser. Cool, you've got Temporalax. Now load it into the veterinary gun. It's in the gadget trolley. In the gadget trolley, you say? Dart gun! Okay. Good. Now the only thing left is to dart the sick giraffe. Shoot the giraffe with the high temperature. Okay. Oh boy. Oh no. Okay, so I gotta, okay, we gotta find Poe. How would I know? That's Bo. That's clear. There's Poe. Poe! Are you not doing so well, buddy? Huh? Are you not doing so well? Aww. Uh. You have cured all the animals. Huzzah! You know what? I haven't pet you guys. Okay, no, never mind. You're fine. Just don't leave the thing open, right? Close it, and we'll be good. Huzzah! If he's gonna stand here, I swear. I got a gun! I don't like that. This is intentionally creepy. You done? Being so creepy? Went smoothly? Seems like it. I did this for the first time. Hopefully he'll get better soon. Well, don't doubt that. We need to get back to the hub. Okay. Return to the hub. What does the, uh, um... Okay. The hub. 
Huzzah! Can we talk about why you smell so creepy and why are you looking at me like that? I mean, I have a wife. I'm happily married. Oh, your smile disappeared. Oh, never mind. It's back. Oh, boy. Let's go. Escort me to the exit. It's time to leave you alone with our lovely zoo facilities. No! No, don't leave me! Okay, what about my wife? Every zookeeper is entitled to a service car. This one's mine. If you perform well tonight, you'll get one in the morning. Is that your wife? Should I tell her you're staying here for the night? Keep in mind, I'll lock you in until morning. No problem. I think we'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. Good luck, Paul. Don't mess up. Huh. Giraffe storage gorilla penguin. Okay. Record the symptoms tasks. Check the next enclosure. Feed the animals. All right. Cool. Paul, you entered here who knows how long ago. If you're not answering calls, I'm worried. Lily, sweetheart. Sorry. Didn't hear you right away. Everything's okay. They put me on probation, but I had to start immediately. Okay. You should just go home. I'll be back in the morning and tell you everything. Paul, but I saw them lock you up. It's not normal. Yeah, it's just protocol here. They took away my phone and made me sign an NDA. And all I have to do is feed and treat the animals. Oh, uh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away. Okay. Put a meat brick in the parcel for Lily, huh? The animals can wait, right? Am I stealing? Am I, am I thieving? Is that what's happening here? Oh boy. Um, what am I doing? Oh, what am I doing? Suddenly I'm all kinds of what, oh no. Oh boy. Ah, uh, wait, the food thingy was on, wasn't it? So what am I supposed to, how do I, do I have to get the trolley first? Oh, I see. Maybe I have to actually get the trolley first. A chunkus. And then... All oh, right, I have to drag this ish. Oh, I can actually sprint. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. They won't miss a meat. Well, the... First day on the job, huh? <laughs> First day on the job and we're stealing meat. Lily, are you here? Yeah. Take this. Give Gina a kiss from daddy. It's time for me to work. Okay. Still straight from the, uh... Oh. Penguin, no fish, gorilla. We need vegetables. Right, I need more vegetables. Gonna go check out the gorillas. Vegetables. Got it. So put that down. I was gonna grab more herb, regardless, and put that there. We need fish for the... Wait, hold on, can I do this? Uh... What was that? Load that up. Gonna make some gorilla. Food, there we go, all right, so... Gorilla cook okay cut they need one kg so that's like straight in the middle right wait the there need 2.5 that's about there oh i'm do boy okay food is ready got it okay cool so now we have to go to. Oh, there's a wallaby station too? Oh boy. That's not good. Did you give me three to do? I don't like this. I do not like this one bit. Uh, 
Where's the gadget trolley? Hiya! Cool! Gotta see what's wrong with our gorilla. Oh, put that back. Oh, okay. We. I'm a sprinting. What is that? No. Oh no, you must be joking. Oh, surely you must be joking. Hello? Night zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Oh, thank God, finally. Uh, please don't hang up. I've been trying to reach my husband all day. He's a scientist, Clarence J. Summers. People usually call him CJ. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm here alone. Please check for me. He should be in the lab. Uh, is there a lab here? Oh, I understand. You're new. Then, one last request. Look in his locker in the break room. Code 1768. Ma'am, this doesn't feel right. Paul, I'm begging you. CJ needs to take his medication regularly. I just want to make sure he has them with him. Just uh open the locker. That's all. I'll call back. Okay. Ah. Uh. This is interesting. This is really interesting. Oh, there's a whole lot of stuff around here. Okay, anyway. Oh, Gorillas. Okay, cool. Uh, open the... Oh, there's four of them. There's four of them. Hey, boys. Yeah, hungry. Oh, boy. I don't like this. One of them is definitely not around here where's your food place boys oh there okay cool delicious gruel where oh oh there you are buddy okay you you definitely don't look so good okay hey pepper oh, are you scared ah pepper looks fine what about you guys? Temperature seems normal. Okay. Fine. All right. Pepper, you okay there? You seem unbelievably scared for some reason. Oh! Oh, I see a scar on you. Well, that's not good. No! I definitely have some... So, probably gonna need like some med kit or something to sort you out. Mmm, poop. My favorite. Okay, we'll exit the enclosure. Right! Time to push the old trolley back, huh? La da dee, la da da, la da dee, ta ta ta. Fun night working at the zoo, huh? Okay. So now I gotta take the poop and put it in here. Unless there's something I'm missing, which I think I might. I think it might be like a oh lethal injection. I think the longer I wait, the longer this gets. So I'm actually on a pretty strict timer, I think. Okay. I don't know how long I have to do that. I don't think very long. All right. I'm going to take a wild guess at this. Pepper is having a a good old fun time there. All right. So leave. And then give me this. And then Q. Reload. Right. Pepper! We just got to go find Pepper. There's Dexter. Pepper, you're not feeling so good. No, come here now. Don't run away now. Pepper, you need your dosage. Oh, my lord. Pepper, relax. Did that work? Oh, my lord. That was 2.4. One kg. So, there. 
and tried to measure it out. Oh, perfect. Nice. Okay, cool. Got that. So let's go to the ruse. Um, sure. <laughs> right. Kangaroo time. You can't go to another before finishing. Oh, really? Oh, well, I'm gonna die. Uh, I thought I thought we could have just moved on. Oh, the blood thingy. Got it. Oh boy. <laughs> Pepper. Oh boy. Oh no. Is Pepper still upset? Probably, right? Pepper's about to transform into a mutated being. Did that not get, did that not fix you? I'm sure it did though. Looks like you got a bite though. Okay, well that doesn't help. How am I supposed to collect blood if you keep running away? 11,500, okay. I don't know what that means. Okay, so pe there's definitely, I, I know there's something wrong with Pepper, but I don't know what. Okay, we'll get the other two real quick. If I can find the other two. Thor, how do you do, buddy? Okay. Task is complete. I'll go back now. Temperature on Pepper is fine. I did see that. So it's definitely... Okay. It's the sound and the other one. Okay, I know how to fix you. I know how to fix you. Can I, can I make a tranquilizer is the thing. Hold on. Because we need to, we need to shoot Pepper. Tranquilizer. There we go. Okay. Pepper, I'm so sorry about this. You're going to hate me, but it's okay. I need blue pepper. Sorry, pepper. Sorry, girl. Okay, come on. I need to, uh... Draw blood from you? Yeah. So it is. It's this one. So how do I fix this? It feels like it's blood disease, so it should be B guard. Oh boy, I hope I get this right. I really do hope I get this right. Okay, surely that must be the right one. Bacterial infections. This is the one. Oh, I'm so stupid. The poor... I've over-medicated the gorilla. Okay, surely. Surely. Experiment or something? Mimic... Oh. Wait a minute. Maybe I need animal blood for this. Maybe this is the one. Oh. Maybe, just maybe. That's a parasite. We, we said it was? Leptospirosis. This one. Okay, cool. I get, I get the feeling that it might just be that. Oh, I see. Okay. Surely. Surely I got you, right? Okay. Maybe it's this one. I think this should be the one. Okay, my goodness. Am I so dumb? And now you walk in front of me. Good! Just what I wanted. Can you just, please? Oh my gosh! That took forever! Because I'm stupid! Phone? Yeah, that phone's ringing. Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. I'm sorry, ma'am. I haven't had a chance to look around yet. What's with the ma'am? Oh, nothing. A woman called. Looking for someone named CJ. Searching for her husband. That bitch again. Oh dear. Oh, CJ's no saint either. Always hanging around some girls, lying to his wife that he's in the lab. Oh dear. And we don't even have labs here. Anyway, forget it. 
Why am I calling you? There'll be a food delivery soon, and you need to grind some fresh meat. Got it? Yes, sir. Excellent. I'll call you later. Uh... Sure, sir. If you don't mind. <gasps> Whoa! Why am I- why am I the vomiting? Okay, let's go back to the hub. Still have penguins and kangaroos to sort out. Or wallabies, as they're called. My god. Why? Delivery? Okay. Sure. Oh! Hello? Damn. I, I mean, Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Don't worry, Paul. It's me again. How's it going? Do you need any explanations? Oh, I definitely do. I thought you had beef or, I don't know, lamb in the fridge. And there... And there's a long-necked pig. You see, Paul, dozens of parasites spread from the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals and they turn into... How shall I put it? Well, monsters. And they have specific tastes. They need meat. What the... What the hell is the mother? <laughs> Relax. The mother is securely locked away. Not much is known about her, so they study her. Forget about it. You know your tasks. Don't worry about the rest. Fuck! I gave a piece of meat to my wife. You did what? <laughs> Sorry, Paul. But it's really ridiculous. Life gives you a chance to become a worthy, well-off person, and you take the easy way. Descending to simple theft. There won't be any more indulgence. So if they say grind bodies, you grind. They'll say kill, you kill. Got it? Got it. Just tell me where my phone is. I'll call Lily. Maybe she and Gina haven't eaten yet. I won't allow it, chum. If you call your wife, it'll be a direct violation of the NDA. No, Paul, you won't drag me into this. You'll have to fully feel the consequences of your misdeed. And now stop whining and go to work. I knew taking that meat was a horrible idea. I knew it! I'm gonna end that there. Hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did, consider hitting the like button, subscribing for more of this. What have I gotten myself into? And until next time, look after your animals.